Ready? And action! Hi, Grandma! How are you doing? Chaco says hello, too. Bye! <laughs> How is that? Mm -hmm. Fantastic! Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> hmm? Um, Chaco and I are going to play in my room. Have fun, sweetie. I'll send your message to Grandma. Bye, Dad! Hurry, Chaco. Uh -huh. We meet us in Rainbow Village. Ha! Ready, Chaco? Rainbow Village, here we come! Oh, Ruby, Choco, are we glad to see you. How can I help, Mary Ling Ling? We're trying uh, to make a movie starring Princess Kiki, but no one knows what to do. Yeah, we don't even know what the movie's about. Princess Kiki, I didn't know you were an actress. My secret dream has always been to be a movie star. I guess it just wasn't meant to be. Hmm. I suppose I shall take my royal nap. Oh. Oh. Hmm, napping Kiki, napping Beauty. Sleeping yeah. Beauty! That's it! Oh. You can tell the story of Sleeping Kiki. Oh, who's Sleeping Beauty? Sleeping Beauty is one of my favorite fairy tales. You could do it like this. Mm -hmm. Once upon a time, there was a beautiful princess named Princess mm -hmm. Kiki. She invited some friends to her party, including her best friend forever, good fairy Ellie. <laughs> but she didn't invite the not-so-good fairy Gina. <laughs> so, not-so-good fairy Gina put a spell on Princess Kiki so she would fall asleep for a hundred years. Oh, I do love sleeping in. But good fairy Ellie changed the spell so that if a handsome prince brings Princess Kiki a pink princess posy, she'll wake up. <gasps> I know someone who's just perfect to play my prince. You do? Who? <laughs> <laughs> oh, little bird, I need you to fly to a faraway land to deliver a message to Prince Frederick. Tell him we need him to star as the prince in our movie. Hurry back, little bird. Let's see. To help make a movie, I'll have to give everyone a different job, know how to tell a good story, and be really organized. <laughs> Luckily, I have some helpful things in my rainbow roller. Something. Don't worry, I'm sure you'll remember it. <laughs> oh, my lovely friends!
Princess Kiki. Oh, say your line. Oh, thank you for coming to my party. Oh, thank you for asking us, Princess. You're welcome. Is anyone ready for Mookies and Kilk? Oh, sorry. Mm. Oh. That's okay, Kiki. I think you're just nervous. Try to relax a little and believe in yourself. <sighs> okay, everyone, let's try that again. Idea, Ruby. What's your movie called? Hmm. 
Huh? The story of Cinder Ellie. <laughs> I'm sure we can find some new tires in here to put on the new wagon I'm making. How did that get in there? That's your old baby rattle. It was your favorite toy for a long time. Huh? Um, you know what, Dad? I'm huh? gonna shake this rattle for all my dolls and see if they remember the sound. <laughs> they must need us in Rainbow Village, Choco. Uh. Ready, Choco? Where Mayor Ling Ling is. Huh? Rainbow Ruby, <gasps> I'm over here. Huh? Ah. Come in, come in. I'm so glad you're here. Of course. Anything for Rainbow Village. <gasps> that's Baby May and little Gigi, and that's Ty. Aren't they just adorable? They sure are, but why are there babies in your office? Let's huh? talk out here so we don't wake them. One of the villager mothers asked if I could watch her children while they took a nap, but I've been called away on important mayor business. Oh my, oh my, I can't just leave them. Let's see, I sure do love babies. I can be really responsible and keep them happy and safe while Ling Ling's away. Luckily, I have some helpful things in my rainbow roller. How can I help? What do I need to do this job today? How can I help? What do I need to say? by being a babysitter. I'll stay quiet so they can get a good long rest. And if they wake up, we can play. And I can take them for a walk in this stroller and feed them with a bottle if they get hungry. Babies love rattles. And of course, a blanket to keep them snugly warm. Oh, Rainbow Ruby, that would be so helpful. Huh. <laughs> uh, don't worry about it. Ling Ling, you can trust me and Chaco to take good care of the babies. <sighs> This'll be easy. We'll just let them sleep until Ling Ling comes back.
May might be hungry. Can we put my 
rattle somewhere safe so I can use it when I get old enough to babysit? Sure. does take practice. What do you think, Ruby? She's beautiful, Dad. She's perfect. <laughs> Thanks, Ruby. Let's see how your doll is coming along. Um, mine's not ready yet. It's not quite perfect. You know, Ruby, there's no right way to make a doll. And it doesn't have to be perfect to be beautiful. I just remembered I left the windows open in my room. I better go shut them or my dolls might get cold. Be sure and finish that doll. You're off to a great start. Mm-hmm. I will, Dad. Thanks. Oops. I forgot to wait for the glue to dry. Guess I'll try gluing her smile on again later. Bye, Dad. <laughs> I wonder what's happening in Rainbow Village. They must really need our help. Hop on, Chaco. Ready, Chaco? Rainbow Village, here we come. Good afternoon, Rainbow Ruby. Chaco, I'm so glad you could come. Actually, today I called you here because we've been working on a very special show, and we'd love for you to see it. Sounds great. We love a good show, don't we, Chaco? Excellent. Right this way. Welcome to rehearsal for Princess Kiki's first Rainbow Aww. Village Ballet Show. Wow. The whole village is so excited. Tonight is opening night. every day to make every move perfect. Ah. And now for the grand finale. Ah. Yeah. Oh. <gasps> Princess Kiki, <gasps> are you all right? <laughs> I'm fine. Just a little stumble. Oh. Oh, goodness. I'm afraid I can't stand up. Let's take a look. Looks like you've got a crack in your china leg. like yours to dry. Oh, I so wanted to make everyone in Rainbow Village happy with my dancing. I know. Send my royal messenger to spread word through the village that the show will be delayed until the glue is dry. Eight <laughs> minutes till showtime! Oh my, oh my. I'm afraid it's too late to reschedule. 
Everybody's already on their way. What if I help you dance, Princess Kiki? You can hold on to me. Why, I suppose we could try. It's no use, Rainbow Ruby. I can't dance. Oh, I don't want to disappoint everyone. <clears throat> Seven and a half minutes till showtime. How do we keep the audience happy even though Princess Kiki won't be dancing? We need to save the show somehow. Yes, Rainbow Ruby. The show must go on. Hmm. I'll need some things to help me entertain the audience. Luckily, I have some helpful things in my Rainbow Roller. How can I help? What do I need to do this job today? How can I help? What do I need to save the day? I can help by being a ballerina. I'll dance for Kiki so they don't have to cancel the show. I have a ballerina tutu and point shoes so I can dance on my tiptoes like ballerinas do. And I have a crown so I look like a princess. Perfect, Rainbow Ruby. You can dance instead of me. I'm not a real ballerina like you, but I'll try my best. <laughs> <laughs> These moves aren't looking quite like Princess Kiki's, are they, Choco? <laughs> Just a little bit higher. <laughs> Don't forget to point your toes. <laughs> Can you straighten your leg, Rainbow Ruby? Ouch! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll say, Choco, ballet is much harder than it looks. <laughs> the audience is arriving! Performance starts in five minutes! I sure wish I had more time to practice. It's okay, Rainbow Ruby. Just try your best. Mm-hmm. Shall I help you to your seat? Why, thank you, Ling Ling. Hmm. Huh? Well, Choco, here goes me trying. Audience happy with your dancing. 
morning. Thanks, Princess Kiki. Like you said, the show must go on. Thank you, Rainbow Ruby. You really saved the day. You came along and helped us in your very special way. Whenever there's a problem, we can count on you. You're a super friend and a super helper, too. Thank you, Rainbow Ruby. All dry and ready for finishing touches. Does this mean you're not giving up on making your doll? Give up? No way, Dad. My doll may not be perfect, but that's okay. It's going to be Ruby style, and that's all right with me. <laughs> <laughs> Zoom! Zoom! <sighs> huh? Whoa, it's late. Time for bed. Good night, Choco. Sweet dreams. It sure is dark in here tonight. Darker than I like it. Why is it so dark? Oh, my star nightlight isn't on. No wonder it's so dark in here. Huh? It's not working. It's so late. I'll ask Dad to fix it tomorrow. Huh? They must need us in Rainbow Village, Choco. Village is just as dark as my room. The stars sure look pretty. Thank you for coming so quickly, Rainbow Ruby. And so late. I'm here to help. I just hope I can see well enough to help. You have a much easier time seeing in Ellie's barn. We have a bright situation going on there. Come on, I'll show you. away from home on an adventure and got lost in the dark. They saw Ellie's glowing tummy and came here. <laughs> Come back here, little stars! <laughs> I didn't know stars were so small. Well, there are grown-up stars and baby stars. These three are babies. Ah! Their parents must be really worried about them. <laughs> Glad you visited, but it's time to go home. Do you know how to find your way home? Can you help Rainbow Ruby? They can't stay here forever. Stars should be in the sky. I'll do my best, Ling Ling. <laughs> hmm. I need to be brave and adventurous and travel up to the stars to help you get back where you belong. I have an idea that might work. And luckily, I have some helpful things in my rainbow roller. How can I help? What do I need to do this job today? How can I help? What do I need to save the day? I can help by being an astronaut. A blast off into outer space? Bring the little lost stars home. I've got my space 
helmet that astronauts wear. When I ride my jetpack out of the rocket, I'll attach it to the rocket with these ropes so I won't float away. I have a wrist communicator to stay in touch with Rainbow Village. This map of the stars will help me find my way around. And the telescope will let me see things far away. <gasps> huh? Huh? Choco will make a fine co-pilot. Follow me, everyone. <laughs> Thanks for staying down here, Ling Ling. I'll need somebody on the ground to talk to if we need help. Good luck, Rainbow Ruby. I'll be standing by. <laughs> Ready for liftoff, Ling Ling. All clear. <laughs> We're out of here. Three, two, one. You'll be home in no time, little stars. We've been traveling for a while. We must be close. Hmm. Let's see here. Looks like if we fly a bit higher, then go to the left, we'll get to the Milky Way, where all the stars live. Won't be long now, little stars. <laughs> <laughs> detour left me all turned around. Does anything look familiar to you? <laughs> Thanks, Choco. I see it. Doesn't look like stars. Can you tell what it is? <laughs> You're right. It does look like Mr. Moon. Maybe he can give us directions. Mr. Moon? Oh, Mr. Moon. Wake up, Mr. Moon. <sighs> no? Sorry to wake you up, but we're trying to find the Milky Way. Could you point us in the right direction? Uh-huh. Oh, hi, little stars. How about that? They know Mr. Moon. Hmm, the Milky Way. Hmm. It's up there. Up there? Uh-huh. Thank you, Mr. Moon. Thank you. Have a safe trip. I'm pretty sure we're going in the right direction. Look, on your left. Huh? Oh, they're so lovely. Look how they twinkle. I didn't know there were so many of them. Neither did I. Little stars. 
I'm gonna miss you, little stars. Me too. Remember, all you have to do is look up into the sky at night and you'll see them twinkling. They won't seem so far away. <laughs> Everybody inside for takeoff! <laughs> Rainbow Ruby, a brilliant job as usual. Thanks, Ling Ling. Operation Return the Stars Home was a real blast. <laughs> Thank you, Rainbow Ruby. You really saved the day. You came along and helped us in your very special way. Whenever there's a problem, we can count on you. You're a super friend and a super helper, too. Thank you, Rainbow Ruby. <laughs> Let's see if we can find your new star friends out there. Look, Choco, over there. There's one winking at us. And there's Mr. Moon. Oh, and another one. <laughs> Maybe some more red here. Or blue. Hmm. No. How about green? <laughs> Look, I want. <laughs> <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> That's very creative, Ruby. Thanks, Mom. Huh? What's in the box? Oh, I was looking through my old jewelry box and see what I found. Wow. It belonged to your great grandmother, Ruby. We oh. named you after her. Look how it shimmers in the light. It's so beautiful. Why don't you wear it all the time? Oh, the pin on the back is broken. That's why I keep it safe in this case. I'll get it fixed someday. Huh? Oh, someone's at the door. I'd better get that. Have fun with those ribbons. Mwah. Thanks, Mom. Huh? <sighs> uh. <laughs> Hurry, Choco. Looks like they need us in Rainbow Village. Ready, Choco? Rainbow Village, here we come! It could have happened to anyone. <laughs> Cheer up, Princess Kiki. We'll find a new one for you. But you can't, Thunderbell. It was the only one like it. And now I've broken it. Why was I so clumsy? Oh, Rainbow Ruby. We're Ooh. so glad you're here. Huh? As you can see, there's been a terrible accident. What happened? Oh. Huh? Prince Frederick sent me this beautiful friendship gem. I was showing it to my friends. Frederick's letter said it shimmers in a most amazing way. <sighs> Ooh. Ooh. Can I hold it? Can I? Can I? Huh? Gosh, I don't think that's a good idea. Hmm? Frederick sent the jewel to me. <laughs> it's okay. I'll be careful. Mm. <laughs> oh. <gasps> my friendship <laughs> gem!
can't put Kiki's gem back like it was. Huh? Maybe I can make it into something different. I just need to think about it in a whole new way. Luckily, I have some help huh? with my rainbow roller. by being a jewelry designer. I'll use this sketch pad to draw some designs. My light up magnifier will help me see the gem up close. This chisel and mallet will help me shape the metal for the jewelry setting. And I have a crimper and pliers to put the jewelry pieces together. Will it shimmer the way Frederick said it would? I hope so, but there's only one way to find out. Come on, Choco, let's head over to the design studio and get to work. I think something like this. What do you think, Choco? Ooh. <laughs> Great. I'll get right to work. Rainbow Ruby? Prince Frederick will be here any minute. Well, Kiki, what do you think of this? <laughs> oh, it's ah. beautiful, Rainbow Ruby. Ah. Ooh, a perfect ring for a princess. Oh? Hmm, but something's not quite right. Tell me, what is it? It's just... It's so sad that we couldn't use those gems, too. Do you think you could make some jewelry that uses all of the gems? Okay, I'll try. Mallet and chisel, please, Choco. Shimmer. happened. This morning I was following a very rare butterfly and wasn't watching where I was going. I tripped and my glasses fell into the royal fountain. Princess Kiki! Huh? <laughs> Hi, Prince Frederick. Kiki, I think I've 
figured out how to make the gem shimmer. But in order for that to happen, you need to share the gem pieces with your friends. Will you share the gem pieces, Kiki? Hmm. Certainly, Rainbow Ruby. Great. Take one, everybody, and hold it in the sunlight. shine even brighter. Whoa, I had no idea it did that. The friendship gem is even more special than I thought. And Rainbow Ruby, you are one very special friend. And you've made me one very happy princess. Thank you, Rainbow Ruby, you really saved the day. You came along and helped us in your very special way. Whenever there's a problem, we can count on you. You're a super friend. What do you have there, Ruby? I made something for you. Hmm? A rainbow ribbon to hold your brooch. Huh? Now it's a necklace, and you huh? can wear it and shine all the time. Wow. Oh, Ruby, I love it. And I love you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you, Choco? Rawr! 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 Shh! Hmm. Phew! Coast is clear. You're the only bear I want to see in here. <gasps> Hurry, Choco! Whoops! I'll fix that later. Looks like we're needed in Rainbow Village. Uh. <laughs> Ready, Choco? You're here. How can I help, Mayor Ling Ling? Oh my, oh my. It seems Gina's had a bit of an accident last night. Accident? Are you okay, Gina? I'm fine, but Felicia's fairy house isn't. It's a disaster. This sounds serious. If you show me what happened, I'll see how I can help. House. The rainbow fog was so thick last night when I was flying over the forest, I could barely see past my sail. Next thing I know, boom! Oh, I'm glad Felicia wasn't home and nobody got hurt. But she's going to be back any minute, and she's going to be so mad. Hmm. Everyone makes mistakes. You just need to apologize. Mm -hmm. Besides, Felicia might not be as upset as you think. Ah! <gasps> My house! Uh, uh, mm, it's ruined! Mm. Mm. Felicia, I'm really sorry. What am I supposed to do without my house? My wings need to stay dry. I can't fly if they get wet. And how am I ever going to stay warm? Fairies get mm -hmm. cold easily, you know. And where will I sleep? And, and... Oh! This is the worst day ever! <laughs> Don't worry, Felicia. I'm sure I can figure something out. Hmm. In order to help Felicia, I need to be a good listener so I can understand what kind of house she wants. And I'll use my imagination to create it. Luckily, I have some helpful things in my rainbow roller. Architects design. 
design buildings and make sure they get made according to their plans. I'm going to design a new house for Felicia. I'll use this big roll of paper to draw a plan for Felicia's new house. This ruler and compass will help me measure and draw straight and curved lines. This special table is big enough for me to draw on my big paper. And my hard hat will keep my head safe when I'm on the construction site. Yeah! Thanks, Rainbow Ruby. But how can there be a construction site if we don't have any construction workers to build my house? <gasps> huh? Good idea, Choco. I bet Thunderbell and Mr. Sloth would love to build Felicia's new house. They're over in Mr. Sloth's tree. I'll go get them. <laughs> the first step is to draw a picture of the kind of house you want, Felicia. Oh. You know, since you are designing a new house, do you think you could make it bigger? And with a wide front door, so I don't have to fold up my wings every time I come in and out? You got it. <laughs> this drawing will be a plan to show construction workers how to build it just right. What do you think of this? <gasps> Whoops! <laughs> You're a choco roll. It's like a map of your house, looking down at the inside. See? Here's your bigger living room. And this is your bigger bedroom. And here's your wide front door, just like you wanted. Oh, thank you, Rainbow Ruby. I can't wait to have my house back. <laughs> then let's get started. I guess. Huh? Do you know it would make it perfect? A special room for practicing my magic. Ah! And can we make it purple? I've always wanted a purple house. <gasps> oh. huh. You got it, Felicia. This is going to be a house fit for a fairy. You know, seeing this makes me start to think of all kinds of new house ideas. I'd love a castle house with a golden balcony. That would be really nice. And how about a windmill like Ellie's? And oh, a clock like the one in Town Square. Clocks are good. And a door shaped like fairy wings. That's not a problem, is it? You got it. I'm so excited. I can't stop fluttering. 
Okay. You can look now. <laughs> Don't cry, Felicia. What's wrong? I'm not crying. It's just... It's just so perfect. It's better than perfect. It's... It's... door that won't scoosh your wings. And it's purple. There is one more thing that's different. You're up, fireflies. Wow. Now everyone will be able to see your house, even in rainbow fog. Mm. <clears throat> oh. Alicia, I'm so sorry. It was me who crashed into your house and made it fall. Oh, I know that. I ran into Ling Ling on the way here and he told me everything. And you're not mad? How can I be mad? I have an amazing new house built by my amazing friends. I'm the luckiest fairy in the whole <laughs> world. <laughs> Thank you, Rainbow Ruby. You really saved the day. You came along and helped us in your very special oh, way. Yeah. Whenever there's a problem, Rainbow Ruby. Just like new. Plus, Mom found us another old box. So the best part is... There's room for all of us. <laughs> I have plenty of fruit left over. What should we do with it? Hmm. How about juggling? in my room. Okay, sweetie. <gasps> uh. Hurry, Choco. Looks like they need our help in Rainbow Village. <laughs> Ready, Choco? You're here. We have a problem with... My sorbet machine! Sorbet machine? <sighs> I brought it back from my latest adventure to make rainbow sorbet for everyone in Rainbow Village. Yum! I love sorbet. <laughs> it's like ice cream but made with real fruit. Yellow is bananas, green is grapes, blue is blueberries. And red, strawberries? Yes, but that's the problem. Huh? It's not just strawberries in there, so I can't make the strawberry sorbet. Oh my, oh my. Somehow all of the mm. strawberry decorations wound up in the container. Hmm, I wonder how that happened. Mix all the reds! <laughs> Long. I promise sorbet to everyone soon. Mix all the reds. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yes, Mr. Lulu. I know you need the handle back. I'm working on it. 
I lost my machine handle, so I had to borrow one from Mr. Lulu. Oh, Rainbow Ruby, I need help fast! Hmm. To help Gina make her sorbet quickly, I'll have to be clever and careful. I need to find a way to separate the strawberries from all the other red objects that don't belong in her sorbet. Luckily, I have some helpful things in my rainbow roller. I'll do experiments to find the fastest ways to separate all the strawberries from the other red things in the container. My lab coat and goggles will protect my eyes and clothes. My science kit has everything I might need for a science experiment. And this clipboard will help me keep track of the experiment results. Yeah! <laughs> the Rainbow Village Restaurant Kitchen can be our science lab. Now let's do some science! <laughs> <laughs> we need to separate all these things from the strawberries. Small berries, metal strawberry decorations, and red marbles. Let's experiment to find the fastest way to do it. Hmm? Choco, no! <laughs> Small berry's a chortle berry. Eat one and you laugh for an hour. Well, hello, Rainbow Ruby. <laughs> Hi, Ellie. Jesse said you were here, so I thought I'd pop in and say hello. Gina, I'm really looking forward to the sorbet you promised. Uh, <laughs> it's going to be uh, delicious. <laughs> <laughs> are much smaller than the strawberries. See? They go through the cup handle, but the strawberries are too big. Hmm, how can we separate lots of them fast? Aha! Hmm. Hey, this net might be just the thing to keep the strawberries in and the chortleberries out. Chortleberry separated. One down, two to go. The real strawberries and the decorations are the same size. How can we separate them? Seems like it's made of metal. Maybe a magnet could be useful. A magnet attracts things made of metal. <laughs> See? The real strawberries aren't metal, so the magnet doesn't stick. Neither do the marbles. They're made of glass. Now let's see if the magnet attracts the strawberry decorations. <gasps> Rockin' rainbows! It worked! We should probably give these decorations back to Ling Ling. He'll want to put them up in time for your sorbet party. <laughs> <laughs> These are all the decorations you were missing. Thank you, Rainbow Ruby. We'll hang them up. Everyone's awfully excited for Gina's sorbet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. It's not ready yet. Am I going to disappoint everyone? Not if I can help. Back to the lab. Strawberries and red marbles. Same size, so the net won't work. And neither are made of metal, so the magnet won't work. Doomed. We're doomed! Don't worry.
worry, Gina. We'll figure it out. Let's see. The marble feels heavier than a strawberry. I wonder. Sink. I think I know how we can separate the marbles from the strawberries. sneakers, and I've ridden everywhere my roller skates. <laughs> it's hard to get rid of things I had so much fun wearing. I'll have to get back to these clothes and shoes later, Choco. They need us in Rainbow Village. Ready, Choco? Here we go! problem. Rainbow Village. See you tomorrow. Uh, uh, oh, thanks, Mr. Sloth. Oh, my feet are so sore from all that running and hopping. Hmm, I need to be creative and invent something to help Thunderbell make his deliveries fast without his scooter and without his 
feet getting so sore? I have an idea. Luckily, I have some helpful things in my oh. rainbow roller. I'll design a pair of shoes for Thunderbell that are really fast so he can make his deliveries on time. And really comfy so his feet don't hurt. I'll design the shoes on my sketch pad. And I'll measure his feet so the shoes fit. I have a kit full of tools and decorations to help me build them from the materials in the design studio. Oh, can the shoes look cool too? Definitely. Let's go over to the design studio and get started. <laughs> always wanted green shoes. How about something like this? Wow! These shoes look so cool! The stripes even match my ears! Whoa, whoa! Thanks, Rainbow Ruby! Off for a test run! Oops! <laughs> I forgot to put my shoes on. What happened? You went so fast you wore right through the soles of your shoes. Easier to skid to a stop on my scooter than on my feet. Hmm, let's see. I know. A double thick rubber sole should fix that right up. Oh, 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 oh. Thank you! These feel nice and bouncy. Thunderbell? My new shoes look cool and my feet don't hurt anymore, but now they're so heavy, it's hard to run fast. I'm exhausted. Must be the extra rubber on your sole that's making them so heavy. What do we have here that could help Thunderbell's cool shoes stay sturdy and strong but go faster? Springs. Hmm. These will make your shoes really light and really bouncy. Bouncing and running should help you move even faster. I love bouncing. shoes has spread across the village. May I please have a pair fit for a princess? Sure, Princess Ooh. Kiki. Being a shoe designer is even more fun than I thought. My princess slippers are all made of china and gold, of course. We only have cloth and rubber. Cloth and rubber? How fun! Will all of the jewels fit? Um... We don't have any royal jewels, Princess Kiki. Good thing I brought my own. A smart princess always thinks ahead. Hmm. Almost perfect. Just a few more sapphires to match my tiara. Are you sure? There's an awful lot on here already. Oh, Rainbow Ruby. A princess can never have too many jewels. Oh. <laughs> Absolutely divine! Oh no! I can't have royal.
little jewels scattering all over Rainbow Village when I walk. That's okay. We can replace the heavy jewels with sequins and glitter. That way, they'll be just as shiny, but feel a lot lighter. There! Now try. Oh, they're the most beautiful shoes in the world! And they're so light! I'll just float into my royal carriage. <laughs> nice shoes, Princess! I like the shoes you made Kiki and Thunderbell, too! Think you could design a pair of boots for me? You bet, Gina! Let me grab my sketch pad! Uh-oh! Looks like we're too low on supplies to make you a brand new pair of boots. <sighs> hmm... But we could make the boots you're wearing extra special! Ooh. Sounds like an adventure to me! What do you think? The sails match your boat, and I tied them on nice and tight so they won't come off when you do your flips. <laughs> I think I've never flipped higher in my life! They're sailtastic! Rainbow Ruby, I can't thank you enough. Everyone in Rainbow Village is admiring my new royal slippers. <laughs> These shoes got me to the forest and back even faster than my scooter! That's great, Thunderbell. Now you'll be able to deliver your packages really fast. Yeah! <gasps> packages? Oh, no! I was busy testing shoes and I forgot about them! Oh, and now I'll never get them delivered by the end of the day, not even with these fast shoes. Don't worry, I know just the thing to do. <laughs> you should get all the packages out by sundown if you work together. Thanks for designing my shoes, Rainbow Ruby. And everybody else's. <laughs> Thank you, Rainbow Ruby. You really saved the day. You came along and helped us in your very special way. Whenever there's a problem, we can count on you. You're a super friend and a super helper, too. Thank you, Rainbow Ruby. There. Now these look pretty enough to wear to a party. Huh? I don't even have to get rid of my favorite roller skates. These fit you perfectly, Choco. Mmm, <laughs> dinner smells so good. It sure does. We're lucky to have an expert chef cook our meals. And an expert dishwasher. We're a good team. <laughs> Is there anything I can help with? What about setting the table? Okay, let me get started. <gasps> before I get started. I forgot something in my room. Okay, we'll be down here getting ready for dinner. See you soon. Ready, Choco? Ooh. Rainbow Village, here we come! <laughs> It's a disaster. We sure could use your help. It doesn't smell like a disaster. Oh, everybody wants to try the new rainbow menu. Delicious foods in every color of the rainbow. The restaurant can't keep up. As you can see, we have many frustrated customers. Hi, Rainbow Ruby. I don't know what's going on. 
Poor Jesse is so hungry. We've been sitting here forever and haven't even looked at a menu. That's not good. <laughs> The Harmony sure seem frustrated. Oh, Mayor Lingling, Ling, thank you ever so much for bringing Rainbow Ruby to be my huh? personal server. Mm. I don't think they realized there's a princess in the dining room. Restaurants usually don't have personal servers, but I'll make sure you're taken uh -huh. care of. Oh, thank you. I'm so confused. I've never waited for food. Hopefully, you won't have to wait much longer. <laughs> the chefs worked so hard to create special rainbow dishes for everyone to enjoy. But no one seems to be enjoying themselves. Looks like Thunderbell and Mr. Sloth could use some help. Thunderbell was kind enough to fill in when our waiter got sick, and Mr. Sloth came in from the forest to help when he heard how busy his friend was. Sorry! Oh, dear. Hmm, how can I help? I need to be quick so everyone gets their food and drinks faster. And I need to be organized, neat, and friendly so people enjoy their meals and have a nice time. Luckily, I have some helpful things in my rainbow roller. How can I help? What do I need to do this job today? How can I help? What do I need to save the day? Help by being a waitress. Diners can tell me what they want to eat from the menu, and I can write down their orders on my pad. And I can serve the food from these trays fast. Hey, Rainbow Ruby, Choco, two rainbow sandwiches, or was it three? And a green pizza. Wait a minute, we're not serving pizza. <laughs> Whoa. How about Choco and I lend you a hand? <laughs> and a paw? Thank you, Rainbow Ruby. Thanks a ton. Great idea, Choco. While I take the orders, you can take the dirty dishes off the tables. Huh? What can I get you? We'll take two red and blue parfaits. Jesse eats pink rainbows. Coming right up. <laughs> Especially for you, Princess oh. Kiki. Oh, thank you ever so much. Why, it's pretty as a picture. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? I seem to be missing my golden knife and fork. Uh. And my crystal goblet. <laughs> I'm sorry, Princess Kiki, but the restaurant only has regular silverware and glasses. <gasps> my goodness, it works just like my gold fork. Thank you, Rainbow Ruby. Mm -hmm. Huh? Rainbow Ruby, may I please have some royal rainbow tea? Certainly. Hmm? Not too hot, not too cold, please. Hmm. And three huh? and a half lumps of sugar, please. Uh... Oh, and the fruity dessert, please. Mm -hmm. Whoa, I've got loads to do. I'd better move fast. Red and blue and yellow and green parfaits. <laughs> uh, sorry. Wait, that's Gina and Jessie's meal. Working out. I need a new plan. Hmm. <laughs> Those three work much better as a team, with each one doing what he's best at. <laughs> Thunderbell, I think you might be better at clearing dishes than serving them. You won't have to be quite so careful. 
Yeah, I'm not so good with careful. Mr. Sloth, you're good at serving drinks, but you could use some help being speedier. Let's see. Thunderbell, could you loan Mr. Sloth your scooter? No problemo! some help with her. She can be your special mission. Try and keep her happy. Yes! Thanks for arranging the dishes by color! Makes it easier for me to find my orders. Almost done. All I'm missing now is your fruity dessert. Oh. Huh. I would love to eat this with your fruity dessert spoon. It would be nice to have my royal teacup direct from the palace for our special customer. so much, Rainbow Ruby and Choco. <gasps> Yay, Choco! Good job with your special mission. <laughs> Take care of Princess Kiki. <laughs> Thanks for the meal, Rainbow Ruby. That was taste-terrific! <laughs> Rainbow Ruby, you did it. You helped make the Rainbow Meal a success. Glad I could help. Thank you, Rainbow Ruby. You really saved the day. Whenever there's a problem, we can count on you. You're a super friend and a super helper, too. Thank you, Rainbow Ruby. Just in time for dinner, Ruby. And just in time to set the table. How about you sit at the table and let me be your waitress? What a lovely idea. Thanks for setting the table so beautifully. And serving it so nicely. We make a great team. We've got the chef, the dishwasher. And now we've got a waitress, too. Now let's be the eaters. <laughs> <laughs> 